Hi guys, this is Android5.com and I'm here with a game called Master Shooter 2 Back to Earth. It comes from Game Lion and we're playing it on the Asus Memopad HD7 tablet. This is the Twin Stick Shooter. It's available for free and it takes up about 600 megabytes of space. The game comes with Google Play Games integration and since it's a dual stick shooter, a twin stick shooter, we have one stick for moving around, this one on the left, and one for the aiming. You can also swipe here to change your weapon and you can use a potent nail gun. The soundtrack has some very cool dubstep tunes and they actually did a very fine job. As you can see I'm picking up dollars after killing the enemies. Dollars that I'm going to spend for getting new weapons, upgrading my weapons or getting items. The environment around you is destructible. I can destroy this police car if I want to. As you can see it just blew up. And actually the graphics are kind of hot for a game that's supposed to be a mere twin stick shooter. You can also get various perks during the battle like this one, allowing me to get more cash out of my victims. And the missions are divided into simply surviving, like this mission here. You have to survive waves of enemies, or kill them all, or escort a certain character, or find some files. Of course you can get killed, but you can also pick up some health and as you can see a lot of dollars can be picked up. Yet another perk, there is also a very interesting uh, such perk that will either throw a nuke on your enemies or kill you. Ok, so this is the end of the mission and I get rewarded for my kills with cash and I can go straight to the shop and purchase something interesting. Now we're going to deal with the boss battle. And this is the shop. I can get my SMG, shotgun, spitter, nailer, gutter, spiral, RPG, electro. Perks like more ammo, fast reload, extra cash, bonus speed. And items like mines, grenades, a steam pack, shield, airstrike, nuke. You can also get cash for real money. And you can also upgrade your weapons, so you can make them uh, more effective against a certain type of enemy. So effective uh, for fire enemies, for electro enemies, you can make them uh, more damaging. There's also an area of missions where you can claim certain completed achievements and get your cash for them. There's also settings for uh, graphics, as you can see right here. OK, awesome and mind-blowing, navigation, aim, the co color of blood. It's a very bloody game, so be careful with the children out there. The game offers HD graphics and 80 levels to play with. There's also survival mode. And you can even add a friend and request a co-op. So the real multiplayer aspect of the game involves calling a friend to aid you in a mission and playing a co-op game. As I said, 80 missions await you, some very cool boss battles, pickups in the game, dubstep soundtrack, cool effects, a lot of weapons, some of them pretty pricey, since the game is free after all. There are 4 destructible environments, including suburbs, city, desert, arctic, over 20 weapons. You can even put on a mech suit and drive a robot around while gutting aliens. There are lots of enemies with lots of vulnerabilities. And uh, you can stick to the story or opt for a survival mode or even an endless mode if you feel tough. Overall there are over 100 missions to enjoy here. You can level up and get even more cash. Let's hear that dubstep soundtrack. In case you're wondering, the composer behind this soundtrack is the same guy who did The Witcher. And now let's die. So the composer of The Witcher soundtrack composed these tunes and he did a very fine job if you ask him. The game is very well designed, the graphics are 3D, they're very nice and you can advance in the game without purchases which is always good. Now let's see that boss battle. I have to admit this is my very first boss battle in the game and I'm expecting it to be very tough. He's called Psycho Brain. And I have a feeling I'm going to have to avoid his projectiles 
in order to stay alive. One thing I regret about this game is the lack of possibility to play the levels one more time. So if I want to go back and play an older level, well, I cannot do that in this game. I'm really nailing him, the boss. And now let's select a perk. Let's see, building rage faster would work. Yet another perk. And it seems to be perk day. And now we're changing environments in a sort of flash like flashback. That was pretty weird. As you can see the game is very well done and Game Lion did a real fine job with this game, both in graphics and soundtrack. Also the atmosphere is kind of creepy, kind of nice, cartoonish. Yet another change of environment. And the enemy is dead. Once you get the nail gun and update it properly, you'll see, just like I did, everything becomes much easier. But then we will meet the fire enemies and a new set of weapons will be required. Okay, this is the twin stick shooter. It's called uh, Master Shooter 2. I completed two missions, time to claim the cash. Dubstep again, I leveled up. Okay, so Twin Stick Shooter, we're liking it very much. We're giving it a 9.7 out of 10. This is AndroidPipe.com. And we had a great pleasure of playing this title on the Asus Memopad HD 7. A great title, you should surely download it. Game Lion did a fine job and you can actually advance without purchases. So 9.7 out of 10, a very fine product, a very fine game.